How die hard Bills fans can be, and they definitely know how to pack Highmark Stadium, getting super loud. But Wegmans is packed as well. No kidding. We told Jim Friday how Fisher Price teamed up with the Bills and Wegmans to create these little guys, the little people. Come with a mini Josh Allen, Sean McDermott, and two members of the Bills Mafia. One has a chicken wing hat. Well, as soon as they went on sale, lines were out the door for them. This was from a launch event for the toys at the Depew Wegmans. They sold out really early into that event. They didn't even expect that to happen. And now some of the toys are already showing up on eBay where they're selling for more than $100. So Taylor Epps is live at the Wegmans in Depew this morning. Taylor's telling us when we might see more on shelves in stores. Taylor, how do we get them? Everybody wants to get their hands on them. Ed and Katie, good morning. Now we know it doesn't take much for Bills fans to show up, but boy, do the Mafia show up here at the Wegmans in Depew over the weekend and Wegmans all around the area to get those Fisher Price Little People box sets. Now they flew off of the shelves, but I caught up with one lucky Mafia member who got one and found out when you can get your next chance to get one. We got up here, we got Fred Jackson, we got Stevie Johnson, we got Deion Dawkins, great guy, Matt Deion, love Deion. If it's red, white, and blue, chances are Joseph Pasquantino has it in his collection at his home in Niagara Falls. I collect a lot of uh, different Bills things. A lot of people who are involved in the different Facebook group, they'll always see my name pop up in the group chats. Go to events where I can meet these players too and uh, try to get some personal signatures. Stevie Johnson, met Stevie Johnson, he was a great guy. Over the weekend, he added this Fisher Price Little People figurine pack to the collection. I mean, I just couldn't pass up the opportunity. I went and grabbed one as soon as I felt yeah. that I could. The fact that it donates to such a great cause just makes it even better. He drove down to the Wegmans on Transit Road in Depew to find a huge crowd. I actually seen a mother running with her baby in the little basket and I was like, slow down, man. There's tons in there still. You can get one. But these Bills fans were the lucky few. The collector's boxes flew off of the shelves over the weekend. The Wegmans team expected Bills fans to show up and buy, but not this fast. We definitely had anticipation that um, they would be a hot seller. We actually had what we thought was a supply for about two weeks. Um, and that two week supply went in a matter of a couple of hours. And now they're popping up online with people reselling the $20 boxes for much more. Yeah, I'm seeing them go from anywhere from $100 to $160. But the Little People collectibles yeah. will be back on Wegmans yeah. shelves soon. Within the next two weeks, we're expecting another shipment in. Um, don't have a date uh, specifically yet, but be patient. So there is good news for those of you out here who didn't make it to Wegmans over the weekend. And if you know someone out of state, they are selling them on shelves in Pennsylvania, New Jersey, North Carolina, Virginia, and Maryland. Now Wegmans representatives do ask anyone who is reselling these toys online that they donate that money back to Oshai Children's Hospital because at the end of the day, that's what this fundraiser is all about. For now, we're live in Depew, Taylor Rep, 7 I Windows News. Yeah, hot toys certainly with a hot price as well in certain They're places. So cute. Taylor, thank you. They